the LGB20 user here, and today I'm gonna be doing the Huawei Sensor LTE for Straight Talk, guys. This is a new phone that uh, came out for Straight Talk. I'm not sure when exactly got released in Straight Talk, but this is the phone right here on the website here. Um, the model number of the Huawei Sensor LTE is 87H710VL. So here's the phone right there. A nice looking phone. They're not too bad. Uh, you got the uh, you got the power and volume keys on the right side of the phone. Power button. The volume keys are on top, and the volume key. I mean, the volume keys are on top, and the power button is underneath the volume buttons. All right. So let's go check out this uh, Huawei sensor phone here. Um, I think this phone recently came out. It looks like it, it looks like I guess like Huawei's interface on that because of the icons and stuff, especially like the stock icons and shit. It kind of looks like. Uh, LG's icons a little bit, kind of. Um, so let's go check this out. Uh, it says, introducing the Huawei Sensor LTE with a slick, robust housing crafted from aluminum alloy. That's pretty. Good. That's pretty damn good. Packaged with amazing fingerprint, fingerprint features like the ability to make and receive calls, launch an app, take photos, and more. With all, with, with, with all, with all, with a touch of a finger. So this thing has a fingerprint scan on. That's pretty damn. That's pretty damn dope, man. This tells you that this phone's only available on the forty-five, fifty-five, or sixty-dollar thirty-day plans. It's not available on the thirty-dollar plan, which uh, you don't get on the nothing. It's only available on the forty-five, fifty-five, or sixty-dollar plans only. So that's the front of the phone there. Uh, you got your front-facing camera, earpiece, and shit. Uh, the left, right side, like I mentioned, you do have the power button on the bottom and the volume keys on top of the power button. And the camera does stick out on the back there, as you guys can see. It's about time that fucking straight talk got put more than one pixel up here, man. I mean, damn. So, as you guys see on the back, it, it looks very nice on the back. It says it's made from aluminum alloy, which is pretty damn good. So, aluminum. So, it has that premium build to it, but not the, uh, but, you know, not the sticker shock and shit. Uh, on the back here, you got the uh, camera, the camera flash, uh, the frame print scanners on the back, Straight Talk logo, and the Huawei logo. So that's pretty damn dope, man. Uh, and yeah, it's about time that Straight Talk put more than one picture up. Because the last time I did a Straight Talk phone, they don't, they only had one picture up, and that pissed me off. So, uh, and finally, I'm glad they saw they put a couple more pictures of the phone instead of it, it, it just having one picture. I mean, come on, dude. People want to know what the the fan looks like back of the fan and all that shit and that, you know what I mean yeah it's a nice it's a nice fan all around it's made from aluminum so that's pretty damn good and the Huawei Sensor LTE is once in a 999 guys so not too bad and you're getting uh you're getting good shit here especially with the fingerprint scanner on a budget phone <coughs> it's a definite win and you can add the car if you want to buy it and shit pictures of the uh let me go to features first. Okay, it's on features, alright. So the Huawei sensor LTE has 4G LTE, obviously. Wi Fi, 5.5 inch touchscreen display, it's probably 720p. So not too bad. 13 megapixel right facing camera. Talk time up to 18 hours. External memory up to 16 gigabytes. And I think you get about 9 gigabytes available to you. You also get a micro SD card slot. Um, yeah, there's the dimensions right there. Uh, Bluetooth 4.1, Google Chrome. Uh, that's the default browser, but you can download other browsers if you want. Um, I, I hate Google Chrome on the on on mobile. I just hate Chrome on the on the uh, phone. I just hate Chrome. Uh, the PC PC Chrome is better. Uh, you have an octa core processor. There, and you have GPS and all that good shit. So, um, yeah. Here's the more stuff on the phone here. Introducing the Huawei Sensor LTE. The Huawei Sensor LTE smartphone offers a sleek premium alloy, uh, sleek premium aluminum design, 5.5 inch, picturesque screen, fingerprint sensor, Android 6.0 marshmallow, 13 megapixel rift main camera, and 5 megapixel front facing camera. So, what you're getting here is not that damn, it's pretty damn good, man. Uh, camera capture beautiful 
images with the 13 megapixel camera, including LED flash, autofocus, and geotagging. It's the front there, front and back. The headphone jacks on top, and the charging ports at the bottom, along with your speaker. So that's pretty good. It looks like it has like two speakers on it, but I'm not sure if it's. Oh, uh, it looks like it, it, it has two cutouts for speakers, but I don't know if it's only if it, if it's only one cutout is actually for the speaker. I'm not sure. Um, I'm not sure about that. Uh, display view pictures, videos, games, and more on the 5.5 inch picturesque touchscreen. Like I said, it's probably 720p display, so not too bad. Uh, memory and internal <laughs> memory: six gigabytes of RAM, two gigabytes of RAM. So that's pretty damn good. Not too bad for a phone like this. Connectivity, browse the web, download a game, or upload a photo using the trusted 4G LTE network. It depends on what LTE network it uses. It has a Qualcomm Snapdragon processor. It's a 64-bit uh, octa-core processor, probably Snapdragon uh, 430 maybe, I guess. I don't know. So that's the fan, that's the fan on all sides of there, guys. It's a nice fuck. It's a nice fucking phone, dude. I mean, it's a nice phone. It's phone's very nice for what it is, and you get a fingerprint scanner. Shit, for once, eighty, you, you can't go wrong with this phone, man. You can't go wrong. It, 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 it's a definite win, in my opinion, on the on the uh, on the fingerprint scanner and all that. Right? So I'm gonna give you guys more specifications on the phone, guys. The size. That's the dimensions on top there. The fan weighs 5.26 ounces. It has a 3,000 million battery. Um, I don't know if the back is removable or not. I'm not sure. Talk time about the 18 hours, like I mentioned earlier in the video. Same bad times with the 28 days. It, it supports GSM. So it, uh, it either is working on AT&T or T-Mobile, probably AT&T. Uh, has hair and and all that shit. Uh, what you get in the Huawei Sensor LTE box is you, you get the uh, phone, of course, that includes activation card, services guide, battery, charger, and quick start guide. So, um, yeah, no headphones or nothing like that. But for what you get in here, for what you get in here, man, it's a definite fucking win. Oh, uh, it's not too bad of a fucking phone, dude. For one seventy nine, like I said, you're getting the Android six point Marshmallow. Oh, uh, you're getting a fingerprint scanner for 180. Yeah, it was a fucking win, especially on the budget side of things. Uh, overall, this phone's not that bad in terms of specs. I don't know what it, I don't know how it it performed in in fucking real life situations or anything. But I think it run. Uh, but from what I see on the specs, it's pretty damn good, man. Fingerprint scanner. You really don't see that a lot of, on a lot of uh budget phones like this. You know, you really don't. And, um, I mean, this phone for 180 if you guys are look, uh, if you guys are looking for a decent budget phone on Straight Talk and you guys like Huawei phones, this could be it, man. Uh, it's a nice looking phone. Uh, it has a uh, decent, it's a budget phone, so you do get what you pay for here, so you're not going to get no, uh, no flagship specs on here, but you do get fingerprint scanning, which that's a definite win. Uh, because you can do, uh, I don't think this does this thing have NFC on it. I don't know if it does or not. It has NFC because Android 6.0 Marshmallow supports Android Pay and all that. I don't know if this one has NFC on, on it or not. I don't know. But but for what you get, guys, man, it's not that it's not, it's not that bad. It's a pretty good deal, in my opinion. Uh, fingerprint scanner and all. Uh, Android Marshmallow. Hopefully, this thing will get nougat. We'll have to wait and see about that. Uh, so, don't be surprised if it don't get mar uh, nougat, because Straight Talk, I don't know how good they are with their updates. I'm not sure I'm not sure how Huawei is with their updates or whatever. Uh, camera specs are pretty nice. Uh, the entire memory's not that bad. The RAM's not that bad. Overall, the fans really is really not that bad, man. For 180, like I said, it's a definite win. If you guys are looking, are looking for a backup phone, if you're looking for... A phone for a kid or whatever for your um for an older citizen for for an older person you know for first smartphone user or whatever and yeah I think this phone runs on AT and T because it says G, 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 it says DSM on it so it says 
So it either runs on AT and T or on T Mobile or AT and T or T Mobile. I think it runs on AT and T though, but I'm not hundred percent sure. It's either AT and T or T Mobile because it says GSM on it on the bottom of the page here. So yeah, there it is, guys. The Huawei Sensor LTE. Nice so looking phone for 180. It's a definite one for the budget count for the budget minded folks out there. Fingerprint scanner, Android 6.0 Marshmallow. Uh, a premium design, but but with the, but but without the sticker shock and shit, you, dude, you're getting a lot for this fucking phone. You're getting aluminum. You're getting a premium premium built quality phone here. You're getting uh, yeah, this phone's fucking for for a budget phone. It's a fucking win, guys. So yeah, man, I'm gonna stop talking here and uh yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up, guys. Let Helps me out a lot. Please like and subscribe. Thank you very much for watching my video. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.